guys, Micah Outdoor Living Guy. I just wanted to show you the versatility of a water feature. Here it is in a front courtyard. We're in the Northwest Hills of uh, Portland here. Let me just show you what we're uh, working on and what we're almost done with is just this little fountain. So basically we have a, a seat wall as a backdrop and these three little water, uh, what are they called? Uh, sheer descents and they are colored, they're lit up at night and you can change the colors to them. And then all of the, the ponds themselves are gonna be lit up for night use. It's a very nice sound, it's a welcoming sound, it's a great greeter for the front entrance. So I just wanna let you see that, the versatility of a water feature. There's lots of different ways to make them and you're gonna see some more in this video as we continue. I'm on location here at the job site. Thought it'd be a good job to show you the importance of having water features. There's so many reasons why I'd recommend getting a water feature. They're not only great eye candy from outside of a house, as you can see here, you know, we positioned the whole outdoor living space with the fireplace and the outdoor kitchen. But the highlight really at the end of that is a huge waterfall looking into the woods in the background. So it really grabs your attention and pulls you out further into the landscape. You can tell the big, huge pond we're doing here is going to be tons of room for the koi, which I will show you in just a second. Oftentimes you'll be on job sites, you'll be in the city where there's lots of traffic in the background or there's neighbors. And what a waterfall will do is just drown out some of the background noise. It might be a busy road you're next to, it might be a, you know, a, a, a business park, whatever it could be, that sound of water will drown out all of the activity going on in the background, or a lot of it, I should say, not all of it. It grabs your attention, it pulls you outside into the landscape. It's very dramatic, and it's a great way to soothe the senses. So basically, from inside the house, it's the eye. You're gonna have the eye appeal. Once you come outside, it's the sound. It's that nice, soothing, relaxing sound that you get. And oftentimes you'll have a bench or you'll have a, a destination point over by the water feature because it's just like a, a natural stress relief. You go out there and you can almost just feel the, the stress leaving you as you're sitting next to your water feature. We're at this little makeshift pond that we have as a temporary holding for the koi. You can just hear just with the temporary hoses that we have that are going into the pond, that nice soothing sound that you will get from the waterfall. Of course, the waterfall is going to be much more dramatic, much more soothing on a larger level. But you can understand what we're saying just by the soothing sound of the, the waterfall hitting the pond. We actually have an in-ground slide. It's 35 feet underground and it starts up around the corner here. Basically, we did this water feature as a backdrop. So it's a huge waterfall, but it really, it hides the slide, the ugliness of the slide, but it, it basically gives a very beautiful backdrop for this uh, landscape. This one, I just wanna say real fast, we've obviously faked it. So this stream bed here, it goes into an underground basin and it's recycled to the top before obviously it goes into the pool. So this is actually pool water where this is water feature water. So a little trick that we've done there. If you don't want to go too crazy with a full creek or pond, another thing you can do is a bubbler type water feature. And what those are oftentimes is either they're the classic columns that you might have seen where they have three columns where they, there's water coming out. And I'll actually show some photos uh, as we talk about these. I would either go with three columns or I would go with a boulder, a nice rustic boulder. But that is as simple as even grabbing a boulder like this in a landscape. We can core that and then we can turn that into a water feature, especially if it's one of these that are like a mossy rock boulder. So it has some good amount of gurgle and sound, but it takes up a very low, little amount of space. And it actually is very inexpensive uh, with compared to other water features. I strongly recommend waterfalls and landscapes and let me know if you have any questions. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like, and we'll talk to you soon. Good? Okay. Hey guys, Micah, Outdoor Living Guy. I'm on here, uh, location, blah, 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 blah. Breathe. <laughs> Delete.